Hello Leo, welcome to another WLC Weekly Love Connections reading for you. WLCs are for those of you who are wanting to get insights uh, with regards to your love connections. And um, in particular, if you're dealing with someone. yeah. Um, to all my subscribers, thank you for stopping by once again. Um, information with regards to my personal readings, the tarot decks that I'm using, as well as um, links to my extended reads will all, all be in the description box below. So go ahead and check them out if you're inclined. Okay. This is for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus in love. All right, Leo, we have the Two of Coins, Judgment, The Fool, Queen of Swords, Nine of Swords, wow, Ten of Wands, Strength, Ace of Wands, Knight of Cups, <laughs> Oh, wow. Four of coins. At the bottom of the deck, we have ten of coins. Right off the bat, you could even be married with this person. This is something, um, this is a connection that you've had, uh, pretty much a committed one. If not, this could also be someone wanting stability, long-term stability with, with a partner. Okay. Leo, I'm seeing that um, you're pretty much busy with your day-to-day -day life. Yeah, you're a Leo. You have a lot of things going on. So you have um, priorities. Um, you're juggling things. Uh, for some of you, literally, this could be you. Um, I don't usually translate this to having... Um, multiple partners or juggling people around I don't usually do that but in this energy the two of coins and the judgment as a challenge I do feel that you could be in a, in a place right now where you can't decide you could have some options that you know you can uh, it's good if you're not committed and then you have options then that's good you can't decide right now okay you probably need more time and there's no decision made just yet for some who are in a committed relationship and that you are juggling your priorities, your time, this is telling me that um, you're not making a decision of letting one go just yet. Or you may want to, but you're not able to do that for now. Yeah. There's no awakening yet. You may still be in a stage of, no, I want both, or, you know, I want... What I want is with person A, and another thing that I want is in person B, but no one has all those qualities that you want. That sort of energy and feeling. Okay? The person that you are dealing with, they are starting off a new journey. This could be on their own, or this could very well be towards you too. So there is this energy of them wanting to start something new, yeah? Wanting to risk it out. This could be someone who would um, reach out to you and tell you what they truly want. Yeah. But the thing here is that there is some difficulty in bringing out the truth. And why is that? Or possibly this is the person that you have let go and um, they are not able to let go just yet and now they have this energy of wanting to start something new to take a leap of faith with you all right they see you as someone who is stressed who is um, exhausted um, unable to process things um, accordingly in your mind yeah Okay, I'm also getting that you may see you as someone who is guilty of something. Okay. And uh, they're pretty much very burdened about this. Pretty much burdened about um, this connection you have with them. Yeah. And they're just hopeful that um, there would come a time that they are able to accept this 
with open heart, with unconditional love. And they are hopeful that um, there's probably some form of renewal. They're hopeful that things can heal in this connection. So someone here has, has actually hurt somebody or betrayed that, some, that kind of energy. yeah, Or that um, somebody is not making a choice to go for a long-term commitment. For some, this could be somebody who is still wanting to play the field. Mm -hmm. And they want you to initiate. This person truly wants you to, you know, reach out to them, show them that, um, you know, you're, you have feelings for them, you have passion for them, you are still into them, that sort of energy. They want you to start something new with them. Although, in their heart, they just want to start off with a new journey. And why I kind of smile earlier with the Knight of Cups? Because I feel that, okay, your partner or your person wants to take a new leap of faith. It could be someone with someone new. But I, I see this um, Knight of Cups. So, there's that love offer coming towards you. It could very well be from them. <laughs> yeah? So, that they would be I, then I thought I, I feel that them wanting to take a new leap of faith is towards you although there's still a little bit of holding off here so there could be that and there is that energy coming towards you Leo that um, they may want to talk about how they feel they may want to spend more intimate nights together they may want to be more romantic towards you but the outcome at least in this first spread is that Somebody may not be opening up much just yet, okay? And um, I'll be clarifying these um, cards in the extended. If you're interested, the link will be in the description box below. Um, I'll clarify each of these cards to give us more insights. And um, I'll also be pulling in more messages cards in the extended. So stay tuned. Meanwhile, let us see. What is this? What message do we need to know about this connection? Dwell on what you love. This also tells me that there could be someone in this connection um, who may not be willing to be tied down yet while the other one wants commitment and therefore one party is expecting the other party to change. But here the message is dwell on what you love. Sometimes we can't really force the other person to love. As they say, each one is um, undergoing your own process in life. So you may meet, but you may not be in the same frequency when you meet. So yeah, you could be at the stage that um, they could be at a stage that they're ready to settle down. While you are at the stage of, you know, just discovering the world around you. That sort of energy, so you know, you know what I, I hope you know what I mean, yeah. Let's get you one more. This is pretty that you have options is meaningful. Rock on, yeah. Don't ever think that this is the only one for you, though. Yeah, if you're the one who wants to be with a person and they cannot decide, they can't choose you because they still want to play the field. Know that you have options. Yeah, it's not that you wouldn't or you couldn't have. You have options. It's just a matter of you having that mindset that, you know, you may love this person, this energy right here. You may love this person, but if they are not ready for you, you can definitely open your, your life or your doors to other people. But that doesn't mean that you love them less. It's just saying that your needs couldn't be met by this person, so it's time to open up. Yeah. All right. So let's see what messages do we have. For Oops. Wow. That's very loud. <laughs> see what messages do we have from the person you're dealing with, Leo? So what I'm getting is they want you to initiate. If not, I feel that they are moving. You try. They will try to move on to take a new journey in life. I am working towards a better future. Yeah, and that's the way to 
take a new journey. I just got caught up in the moment. This could be them telling you that, okay, we tried it out, let's say for the first three months, we tried to get to know, and um, now this person realizes that maybe Leo, you're not yet ready to make a decision or you're not ready to commit or vice versa. Then the other person thinks that, okay, maybe, maybe they tried to work it out further with you, and yet, you still didn't you still both did not get the desired outcome and therefore this person right now is um moving towards a new journey in life wanting to embark in the new journey and then just told themselves that you know i just caught up in the moment with that leo with the cycle with leo now it's time for me to start something off a new one again energies could be reversed so let's see how this pans out but I feel this person could likely be starting somewhere else. I'm afraid to take that next step right now. I'm getting that this energy is from this person right here. Whoever is resonating at this side. This is my new uh, message deck. Let's see. Um, you feel like home to me. Who could be saying that? Let's find out and extend it if we can get more messages. And um, I'll get more messages from this deck as well in the extended. Um, let me know how this resonates in your uh, situation in the comment section below. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe and share as well as um, click on the notification bell so that you'll be notified as and when I uh, post more videos. And if this is where we part ways, hang on. The extended link for um, the extend the link for the extended video would be in the description box below. If this is where we part ways, thank you for stopping by.